Thanks, Chuck. And you're right, waking up early does make you a white supremacist. And if you thought that was bad, get a load of this. New studies show that white women smile at people when they meet them. I have a genuine question for white women. I know they don't follow me, but hopefully it will reach their side of TikTok. When you guys meet somebody new and you do this thing, is it something that you guys are taught at home? Are you, are you raised to see that facial expression as being polite? Because from where I stand, it's just you're leading with fakeness and it is a generational thing. So that's why I'm trying to understand where that comes from because Honestly, you do not have to do something that you don't want. You don't have to smile at me if you don't want to. You don't have to greet me if you don't want to. You don't even have to look my way if you don't want to. But you doing that thing, it formulates my perception of you. And that is that you are fake because you're constantly leading with fakeness. So I, I want to understand where it comes from. Is it something that you guys are raised with? Is it seen as polite? Is it, what is it? While I am not a white woman, I will be speaking on behalf of white people in this video. Yes, I just gave myself that authority. So she said, what is this thing? Well, you see that thing, this facial expression, it's, it's known as a smile. Maybe a little closer to a grin. Not a huge smile, but it's a smile nonetheless. Smiling. When do we use it, you might be asking. Well, let me explain. To show happiness. Joy. Perhaps openness to be warm and welcoming. To let you know, the vibes are all chill, dog. Me and you, were good, you know? There's no problem here, no beef. Let me help contrast this with some other facial expressions that maybe you don't know about. Which, mind you, infants actually recognize facial expressions. So, let's get back to infancy to help you relearn what these facial expressions might mean. First... That's a frown. Maybe you'll see some body language like this with a frown. This means, don't mess with me right now. I'm in a bad mood. What about excitement? That means the endorphins are going and good things are happening. Don't worry, I'm not going to make you sit through me doing all the facial expressions with every emotion. I understand that you are, in fact, older than the age of three months. So a lot to unpack here. She asks... Is it something you're raised with? Are white people raising their children to be polite and kind and warm and welcoming? Oh no! That facial expression was fear. Heaven forbid people are nice and polite and warm and welcoming. You see the way us white people are raised, you know, not every other person with decent parents and a good upbringing, is that you smile when meeting somebody new to show that we can be friends and whatever this relationship is going to be, whether it be you're just somebody at the grocery store and I'm asking for help, or you're a co-worker, or whatever the case is. Me smiling when we first meet says, I am happy that we are meeting. And it's almost always not fake, unless you're putting on a brave face because you're in a bad mood. But even then, meeting new people should be a good thing. So it should bring a smile to your face, usually. Smiling also says, whatever the goal is, we're going to accomplish it. I'm gonna be really nice. You're gonna be really nice. We're gonna get it done. There's gonna be no conflict. I am fairly confident that most new people that I've met typically smile when I meet them, regardless of the color of their skin. Even when I meet them, you know, a brief interaction at the store, right? Maybe I'm asking the guy at Target, hey, what aisle is so-and-so in? I usually say, excuse me, sir, could you tell me what aisle is so-and-so in? See that? It's not a overzealous smile, but it's a, hey, sorry to bother you, because I know you're busy doing stuff, and I'm, oh boy, am I just a foolish little guy trying to find the toilet paper and I, I'm getting lost in all the aisles. Would you prefer when you were meeting somebody, they'd be like, I hate you. This interaction's gonna be awful. You smell poorly. Nobody loves you. This friendship isn't gonna last long. Also, first impressions are lasting impressions. You see, us white people were taught that, you know, not every other race of people on the planet with good upbringing, regardless of skin color, that initial impression should be strong because later on down the road, if you cross paths again, you'll have a fond memory of them. Or at the very least, not a bad one. But I'll tell you what, at the next white people meeting, I'll let everybody know people are getting offended by smiling at people and we should start being more rude. The little bit of truth in this video, she said it comes off as fake. And it's probably just because of the way this person is. You know, 
why are you smiling at me? If she opens up with a, why are you smiling at me? I'm sure that that smile gets twice as big. Oh, I just am always smiling. Because you catch more flies with honey. If you're a white person, apparently you should stop raising your kids to be polite and kind. Yeah, that's America for you. My name is Beans. Thank you for watching The Daily Beans. Have a blessed day.